about. We're going to bring all of it up. Don't you worry yeah, about man. that. I got some old yeah, ones man. on here. We got to be open-minded here. We'll start with we'll start with the easier categories then, the ones that shouldn't be as much of a debate or argument. But um, we'll start with ref of the year because of. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> Because uh, we all better have Jason Herzog Dean. written down. I swear to God. <laughs> well, the, the re- I will say this: the reason Herb Dean I think won it is based on how many events he refed. Yeah, like hundred eleven or something. Yes, got I saw that hundred eleven. Mark Smith. And I felt like half of those for real. I remember <laughs> saying at, like, at least half the fights when I saw he was refing, I was like, "Oh God, Herb the Reaper Dean," uh, yeah. because and then when he's not the Reaper, he is like. Saving people when like they've had a sneeze and he's like, they're like, oh no, it's it's like either it's too overprotective or not enough. And, he's the salmon with fucking Herb Dean. And if I was coaching, if I was coaching, I knew Herb Dean was my ref. I would say, do a groin shot, do an eye poke. You're gonna get warned. Grab the fence. You're gonna get warned. Use your tools here. Yeah. And the, I, I've said this for a long time. I've probably said this to you, Lewis. Uh, the best fighter in the world or used to be John Jones, right? How many of his fights did he have an eye poke in? Probably 95% of them. <laughs> what a baby. Like, like, oh, like, are you kidding? Whoops, I'm the best fighter. I control all my limbs and body perfectly. I'm accidentally eye poking everybody. <laughs> uh, like, do it. The best fighter in the world did it. Like, yeah. But uh, yeah, Herb Dean's not my, not my pick. Uh, no, Herzog, no. I feel like, is uh, my pick. Uh, and then... Honestly, I really like how, you know, he refs overall and like judging how they judge the finishes is tough because they're all judge they're refing different fights. So the scenarios coming up are like different and that's tough, but I like how he handles fouls. I like how he talks to the fighters. I like how he, you know, kind of just keeps the fighters from like freaking out in a way. Chris Tyone would be my runner up because he I is, think Chris yeah, Tyone also one. does. He does a really good job of it. Sometimes he's a little bit too nice about it though. He's like He's Tim like, I know Con- you didn't mean to. It was an accident. He's like, it's, yeah. Yeah. It's, yeah. he's like, you're doing great in there. That right cross. It's like, dude, ch- it's like, <laughs> like calm down. Like, like, so he's a little bit, but I feel like Chris Tyone is really great as well. Um, you know, but yeah, my pick is definitely Jason Herzog. Like I really, I really think he works well. And for being such a little guy, he like commands like a big presence in there. You he's never look. Out. Don't hate on the little guy. He's got a I'm, I'm not hating. I'm just saying from a physical perspective, he can even judge like the bigger fighters and be able to kind of command a presence. So yeah, hers he's, not for six me. Foot, he's not six foot four, Mark Goddard. He's not big Mark, yeah. Yeah. Mark Smith or Mark Smith or whatever, who like Mark Smith like yells at fighters and like uses his like big assness to like scare him. He's like, hey, stop it. It's like, okay, big. Like, I like Beltran because he's all across the board. He oh, he's everything. Man. That's a great a man. Yeah. yeah. He's no. no nonsense too, which I like. He's uh, he seems pretty on point. If I couldn't pick Herzog, which I'm going to, I'd pick Beltran because he's he's fun. Plus the beard, come on, dude. <laughs> yeah, you can't miss it. He tucks it in as well, rolls it in. Yeah, <laughs> can't beat that. Yeah, yeah. I think I think Mark Smith is a is a good shout based on. But the, I said to I said to you, Bunny, yes, uh, last week, the best thing about a ref is you're not meant to notice them. They're meant to be invisible yes. in the cage, and Herzog is invisible. You he's never invisible. notice him. And whereas like Mark Goddard to me is like. He's the new Herb Dean of ten years ago. He's the but he is the blueprint of how to ref. He does all the he teaches the refereeing course referee courses, but Herzog is just this year no mistakes at all. Phenomenal. Mm-hmm. Third overall most fights refed and mm-hmm. zero mistakes. Whereas Herb's refed double the amount, but he's got double. He's got thirty mistakes in him. And you know, he's, he takes the talking points away from other fighters. Like most people end up yeah. talking about Herb Dean, and we're supposed to be talking about the fighters. Like you anybody exactly. you hear anybody talking about Herzog? No, because exactly. you don't nope. see him because he's doing his fucking job. Exactly. Herb Dean and has got his got his own thread every fucking fight he reps. <laughs> <laughs> it's about yeah. the fighters, you know? Yeah. So does anyone have a have a nomination other than Jason Herzog? Like the proper one? Steve? Everyone... No, I honestly it's it's crazy that we could really pick like four or five other guys that aren't Herb Dean who was picked by Yeah, Herb Dean is not even know. nominated. Just... Yeah, like, yeah. Not... <laughs> he's the highest paid he refs the most fights but you never feel more uncomfortable watching a fight than when he's in there and it's always a main event and you're watching it and you know something's gonna get fucked up and it mm-hmm. happens Herb so, only comes above the guy that did that one fight and i cannot remember his name yeah i know fight. what you're talking about and he I got know, kicked off after he got know. kicked after one fight yeah i cannot remember for the life of me who it was Are you ta- <laughs> is it the brazilian ref 
who let the guy get oh, he's, a half Pol- to death. he's a Polish ref. Oh no. yeah, that guy was really bad. Yeah, yeah. I don't. I remember don't remember. His name. Someone fill me. Do you know what fight it was? I he did, never. I, he never wrapped again. I tweeted. Oh. I, yeah. No, he he literally got pulled from the card mid card. And I haven't seen him. Time. Yeah, I, I remember that. I, I do definitely not do not remember. I I love Beltran though as kind of yeah, a yeah. like a quiet shout out. Like I just feel like he doesn't ref enough. Maybe he's, like he's, he does in other smaller FCs. Like he was at the combat mm-hmm. jujitsu thing last time, and he did a great yeah. job. Like, you know, yeah, he, the only he's, reason you notice him is because he looks like a biker boss. You know, like yeah, that, he does his job and he shuts the fuck up. I love it. I didn't yeah, even I write him. Herzog, though. Yeah, Herzog, Herzog would Herzog would be my pick too. I didn't even think about Beltran though. So no one's rooting for yeah. cigarettes and alcohol. No one's rooting for us. <laughs> I mean, he gave <laughs> he gave think. me my most viral moment in internet history with a uh, you know a random meme you know where I my where my I'm yelling about drunk or not meme. It's a clip on Instagram I where I'm yelling that. about Keith. I'm very proud of that. That's the only people, thing I've ever people done. People love that. Very they aggressive. Love when you were I respect screaming. that. Yep, the, yep. The, I've got the fight. The fight was between Zaleski Dos Santos and Benoit oh, yeah. Saint Denis. Oh, the referee's yeah. name is Vyek Kelesev Kiselev. Remove oh, yes. I see rolled that. right off the tongue, eh? Well, that's, yeah. that's a, that's a t- tricky Dos one. Dos Santos, a- Dos Santos beat the hell out of a lightweight yeah. for 15 minutes yeah. when Dos Santos is nearly a middleweight. Jason and Herzog like, and I have also had a couple of internet. We've been, you know, we've been in contact. Via bias, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Jason Herzog, shocking. Oh man, uh, Herzog has not been interacting with my comments on this. 